guys, it's Hydro Hamster here, and today's video is going to be on comforting your hamster. So it's sort of like trusting tips and how to bond with your hamster, sort of, and just get them to trust you so they're not really stressed out. And this could be for a new hamster, or it could just be for any hamster, um, any age. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video, and let's get started. So the first thing is to make their home comfortable. So I would give them lots of bedding in their cage with a hut they can sleep in comfortably and also give them a large cage so they don't feel enclosed in a small space. The second thing is to always have food and water provided. I would suggest to keep their food bowl filled all the time and it doesn't have to be a lot of food, just something to keep them from stressing out and obviously make sure you're not overfeeding them. The third tip I have is to just get a blanket and put your hamster in it and they might sleep in it and it took a while for my hamster to sleep in somewhere other than his cage um, but it's a great bonding method um, when they do and only do this method when you have had your hamster for a little over a week. You can also give them a small treat once in a while. Um, this is a great bonding tip. And your hamster will soon associate you with yummy treats. Um, for diabetic prone hamsters, don't give them treats with a lot of sugar in them. However, Syrian hamsters can handle more sugar, but I would still avoid it for their health. Another thing you can do is to pet or stroke them. And this method seems pretty obvious, but it really helps if you want to bond with them. And finally, you always have to remember to respect their space. Um, never wake up a new hamster or take their hut away from them when they're sleeping and instead just wait till they're awake. So that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Remember to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Bye!